a very long time before they could figure it out. First, let's talk about light. Light coming from the sun appears white, but it's actually made of all the colors of the rainbow. And like energy passing through the ocean, light travels in waves too. Some light travel in short waves, and other light travel in long, lazy waves. And so, blue lights are shorter than red lights. And as you may know, light travels in straight lines, and several things can happen when it comes to encounter an obstacle in its way. It may be reflected, like with a mirror, bent, like with a prism, or scattered. And so happens when light from the sun travels through the Earth's atmosphere. It collides with particles of air, and the different colors are scattered in different amounts. And oxygen in the atmosphere scatters short waves most, so blue light are scattered more than all the other colors, which makes the sky blue. But wait a second, purple light is even shorter than blue light, but why don't we see a purple sky then? Well, the answer lies with how much purple light is emitted from the sun and how our eyes react to it. Because, on the one hand, purple light represents a very small part of sunlight emissions, and on the other hand, our eyes are more sensitive to blue than violet, which means that when you look up at the sky, your eyes tell your brain that you're seeing blue, even though there is violet there. 